<laughs> Alright, so I just come off a call and we're gonna talk about it very quickly. Okay, so it was five minutes ago in the story style that we do. But basically I FaceTimed this girl and I knew already what I was kinda getting myself into. Very combative, very aggressive. And this is a perfect example, okay? So spoke to this girl for a while stopped speaking for like two two weeks or so and i just sent her a message she replied today like a day later and she was basically on facetime and so I'm like okay cool 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 let's do this yeah i know what type of girl this is uh, she's playing games she's long whatever but you know i want to see her face to face yeah she doesn't send a video or anything let's just let's just see what i go on. so jump on the call she gives me her number i facetime on instagram and again, we've got uh, editors, we've got some screenshots here to show. So we'll put that screenshot there at the end um, to show the call. Let me know. And we FaceTime. So, oh, here we go. Oh, it's my moment of truth to do, 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 do. And she answers. Obviously, I'm not, I don't give a fuck. I'm just trolling at this stage. I know nothing's going to come from it. But I was like, let me, let me just see. There I see her face. You don't look like your Insta photos. <laughs> she looks kind of nice on Insta. You can see big. She looks kind of nice, but again, not being rude or anything, but um, maybe like a point or two below her Insta photos, I'll be honest. Um, I've never really experienced like catfishing like that. I wouldn't say that, but you know, fair enough. It's, it's, she looked okay, but not, not that nice personally. Not that nice for what she's demanding. We're going to see in a sec. FaceTime her. Okay, cool. The first thing she says, come a bit closer. You know what the first thing she says? And this is going to sum up Western women so nicely. First thing she says. I gave you my number for why are you calling me in here? Excuse me? Jesus Christ. The first fucking message. You want to say that to me? I gave you my number, so why are you FaceTime on here? What the fuck? Like, I get it, you're maybe trying to be jokey or whatever, but then later on I found that this is actually how this girl is. We start talking, and the first question I ask her, and Kiri being direct, I say to her, can I ask you one question, princess? She's like, yeah, I'm speaking really calm, relaxed, sitting right here. And I ask her, why are you so combative? Editors, we'll put a screenshot here of that, like, me doing this, the sad face or whatever, and the type of energy she was getting, giving off, maybe one or two here, so just let me know. But that's the energy she was giving off. So I asked her, why, why are you so combative, baby? And she's like, I'm not being combative, I'm kind of masculine as a woman. And you know, I was like, fair enough, if that's how she is, she's kind of masculine as a woman, that's, that's good. I then drew this for her in a FaceTime. I don't know if you can see it. Editors, we might. Can you see that? Get your mirror or whatever. But it's essentially the masculine and the feminine. And then I put like guys more feminine here with like wearing dresses. And then <laughs> how women want a more masculine guy. And this is me and I would like a feminine guy. I just explained that to her. So obviously that was the first incongruency. I saw she was quite masculine. I mean, yeah, quite masculine, obviously masculine. I said to her, if I want someone masculine, I would go to a bro, not a fucking lover. She's like, what, say, you just want your girl to sit there and look pretty? I'm like, oh my God, it's happening again. Uh, every single thing about Western women is right here with this one example. I wish, Lord above, I wish I recorded this. I wish I screen recorded, but it was, it was exactly like a script. Western women being entitled, and we're going to stick out in one second, but Western women being combative, entitled, and fucking giving this, like, fighting energy, fucking, oh, not on your same page, it's really disgusting, I, and it, it's okay if that's what she is, and that's what she likes, and that's fine, because we're just different, and that's fine, but for me, and what I expect, and what we all expect as a man, and what they'll never gauge is that any masculine per person on their purpose wants a feminine wants a feminine nurturing peace of mind girl i even said to her, you know what my therapist he's like what i was like feminine girls he's like oh that's not me then i was like i was thinking imagine going on a date with this girl imagine with some of these exes that this girl's probably had fucking hell she's not even that nice 
she's fucking combative and now the worst part what she demands and again editors will put one or two things here and if you can see that right now i was basically as a joke cussing out like her shoes saying they look crusty or something and she said buy me new shoes then smiley face this is like what i deleted the combo it's probably like the fifth new message but maybe like 15th message in total 20th message buying new shoes she's smiling obviously she's joking do you want my shoe size there's obviously a bit of joke in there but then there's, there's again that element of oh i'm a wallet to you right trying to get something off me trying to extract resources so easily and again again i played along and joked i don't date broke men that's what she said. I was just like joking. I'm only going on 12 holidays this year and all this and whatever. And uh, she's like, I don't date broke men. Again, editors will put it there. Me sad face, her doing that and then whatever. And I just changed the combo. So obviously there's me thinking, okay, it's probably a part of her joking. And then when we went on FaceTime and I saw her energy and how she carried herself. Fucking hell, bro. Fucking hell. And I was like, this is Western women. Welcome to Western women and this is what you need to avoid. Combative, argumentative, aggressive, fucking masculine as fuck girls. The worst part about it, and this is how the convo ends. We're there and I'm like to her, I just wanted to ask in it. I was like, okay, so what would it take for us to go on a date? Because I mentioned to her, I was like, okay, again, being honest. And again, that's the truth. I've only been on one date in four years. I normally just go for walks in the park. She says, I'm like, oh, excuse me, do I look like someone who go walks in the park? Oh, get out of here. If I go Brazil, I find 10 of you 10 times more beautiful who don't ask for anything. Oh my God, you think I'm a, for a bit of puss? Fuck off, man, I don't care. For a bit of puss. All of that for a bit of puss. You want me to lose my mind for a bit of puss? <laughs> She's not even that nice. She's not even that nice. <laughs> this is the dangerous thing and this will fuck you up man i swear i was just like oh my god so i was like okay cool so what did it takes that like, well even with my ex-boyfriends you know we need to go for a meal and, I, and then i said to her and then what she's like well and then we see if we vibe and i was like and then what and she's like well we'll see if we vibe and i was like and then what and then she said we'll see i was like okay i'm gonna okay obviously i'm gonna pay go for a meal five date rule <laughs> all this fucking shit and then, oh, and then I'm going to see if I can vibe and get a, a bit of puss from a 5 out of 10. Yay! And like, no offence though, I'm not even trying to cuss her or anything. But I just value authenticity and I value peace of mind and I value feminine energy. It's just me and I get it. I get it, people are different, but it's just me. Because I understand how many girls, I understand the trajectory. She's 24, I'm 25. And she said, well, listen, you know, you seem like a bit, you're unserious because you've seen me like uh, post uh, girls whining on my dick and shit like that. Like, you seem a bit un unserious. I was like, you know, I post that to get a reaction. And then uh, the convo goes on. And then she says, um, oh, you haven't even dated a girl seriously. I'm like, excuse me, if you watch my videos, you would know. She's like, yeah, that's the thing. I don't know you. I'm like, okay, yeah, so you don't know me. And I said, if you know who I was, then you would be lucky to... She was like, You're, I'm giving you... She said to me, I'm giving you a chance to me. I was like, excuse me? I was like, if you knew who I was, I'm not even trying to say it in a power thing, but if you knew who I was in my trajectory, you would understand that I'm giving you a chance. She just looked at me, just looked at me like that. Like, oh, excuse me, and I literally just said to her at the end, listen, in five years' time, I'm not going to explain this to you because you're a girl and you're not going to understand you're on cuckoo land but I have a good reality in five years time I'm going up here and I didn't say it but she's going down here and I'm not trying to be rude or anything like that or respectful it's just how it works the sexual market value it's just the truth okay if I work continue to work hard which obviously I and you all will so I just deeped it all and I was like this is just perfect this is western women in a nutshell this is uh, I can go to Brazil and find 10 times better who are 10 times less combative it's every single stat is positive she's hotter she's sexier she's more feminine she's more nurturing i really just don't fuck with this combative energy so if anyone asks me what's my type the first thing i say is feminine girls this girl was everything opposite to what i ever look for 
I already unfollowed her before because whatever and I checked and again editors will put the last screenshot there but she unfollowed me straight after so at the end I was just saying listen like if you if you knew like in five years time whatever if you knew who I was whatever and I was like okay and then she was just trying to go on and argue and I was just like um okay I need to just work in it so take care and she's like oh, my then and I was like okay and obviously we're never going to talk again this is just a prime example of what to avoid it's not worth it do you understand for a bit of puss like that it's not real worth it. if you're a virgin just keep a virgin because this is this puss of, of that type of person what they expect and demand it's not worth it they'll fuck up your life just for you it's not worth it just level up and then you can focus and go abroad and get real proper women there are proper women in the western world but they're very difficult to find this is a prime example of what to avoid i'm begging you any type of girl with this energy with those type of messages avoid save your fucking life turn around and run because this one is not worth it in the long term. Yeah, in the short term, yeah, so much fun. But it will fuck up everything, I promise you. You have to understand me. What you want is peace of mind. What you want is feminine, nurturing, loving, amazing energy as a masculine man. This girl does not provide it. So turn around and run. If it was a one night, cool, but... I'm talking walk in a park, beat on the first night. She's talking, oh, five days, oh, fucking shard. Fuck off, mate. <laughs> She doesn't watch my YouTube where she is, then no hard feelings, but you're a bit of a madman. But yeah, bye. <laughs> if you want to fix your life today or have access to my free self improvement guide, all links will be down below. If you also like one on one coaching sessions or like to learn from my Skillshare classes, all links down below. <laughs>